In this video, I wanna show you how to take your holiday get ready with me videos to the next level and keep your audience engaged and happy. What's up, friend? Welcome back to CapCut's YouTube channel. If you can't tell by my ironically tacky holiday sweater, tis the holiday season and therefore tis the season for holiday content. Whether you're vlogging holiday parties or just sharing your holiday celebration prep, there is so much video content to be made and holiday cheer to be shared. And what better way to spice up your holiday content than with CapCut's epic features? Specifically, we're gonna focus on adding engaging transitions and a fun little holiday song. And so without further ado, let's go ahead and open the CapCut desktop app. So you can see that I've already imported and cut together the footage for my holiday party get ready with me video. And as the video stands now, it's fine. It's just a little boring and it drags out quite a bit. And if we know anything about content, it's that we wanna keep our audience's attention. So let's add some transitions to make it a little bit more interesting and quicken the pace. To do this, you're just gonna go to the transition section here on the top left. In this video, I show a holiday makeup look as well as a quick hairstyle. Personally, I find that using a bunch of different transitions in a get ready with me video can be a little overwhelming. So I'm gonna use the same transition throughout the makeup section, and then we'll add a different one to signal to the audience that we're switching over to the hair. For this kind of video, I also prefer to use movement transitions as opposed to light effects or glitches. It just feels a little bit less jarring to me, but of course, in your own video, you can use whatever transitions you want. Let's keep it super simple and just go with the left transition. I'm gonna click and drag this down to my timeline and let go right between my clips. Okay, now that all of my transitions have been added, I'm gonna change their duration so that they move just a little bit faster. You can do this two different ways. The first way is to go into your timeline, click on your transition and just drag the edges. The second way is to click on your transition in your timeline and go to the upper right. Here you'll see that a new section opened for transition parameters and you can just use the slider to set your duration. And the most important part is to apply that duration to the rest of your transition so you don't have to keep going through and doing them one by one. To separate my makeup segment from my hair segment, I'm gonna do a little bit more of a dramatic transition. Let's see what's trending. I'm feeling block glitch. If you've seen other CapCut videos, you know that I love the glitch transitions and effects. I just think they're so cool. So I'm gonna put that in my video. We're just dragging it down in between the makeup and hair segments. Okay, the video looks great to me. Let's just add a little finishing touch. I'm gonna add a fun, festive holiday song. So we're gonna go up to the audio section and here you can search specific keywords to find the song that you want. So some good ones for holiday music would be festive, holiday, fun, Christmas, joyous. I'm gonna go with Christmas. I just feel like I'm gonna find something really festive under there. And let's go ahead and add this song that is aptly called Christmas to the video. I'm just gonna drag it down to the timeline. And then I'm gonna move my playhead to the end of my footage and press W. W is a keyboard shortcut that deletes everything to the right of the playhead. So it's really great for trimming audio to align with the end of your video. And now we have a holiday get ready with me video that is fun, festive, and engaging for the holiday season. Comment down below. I wanna know what your favorite transitions are and what kind of holiday content you're making this season. And with that, we'll see you in our next tutorial. Happy holidays.